And we are back once again to My Hero Ultra Impact. Today we are here doing the brand new event, Covert Operations Carmine. So it's a villain event. Let's see how this is. Covert Operations Carmine 1 of 5. Paranormal Liberation Front, Gunga Mountain Villa Hideout, Vanguard Intelligence Regiment, Carmine Meeting Room. That concludes our list of investigation targets for this week. Is that all for today? If you got nothing else, I like to leave. I'm starving here. Ah, well. Don't go. There are remaining agenda items looking toward our upcoming mission. We must design an activities policy for our regiment. I'll leave that stuff to you guys. Just tell me what you decide after. Ah, there was one thing I wanted to bring up. Can we expand the juice menu for the cafeteria? Just ask the cook that. Do you think you're at our hideout for a vacation? Hi. I figured I should enjoy my time here. Ask the cook. Got it. I'm off to the cafeteria then. Ah, she left. That toga. How can that girl be in the same position as me? I clearly contribute more. She just seems like some high schooler when she acts like that. Hmm, if she were just some high schooler, she wouldn't even be here. In front of the cafeteria. Also, I always wondered, how old is Toga? Like... Are they just saying that she's not a high schooler because, like, she's not in high school anymore being a villain? Or is she not a high schooler because she's, like, too old to be in high school? Because I forget exactly what grade the heroes are in, but she has a crush on Midoriya. And so I don't know if she's older than Deku. Well, I'm pretty sure UA High is a high school but I don't know what grade of high school they're in oh it's Toga hey Toga Jin are you getting some food let's eat together eat alone why don't you sounds good what are you having hmm what to eat I want something filling. A light salad should be fine. Pardon me for interrupting your conversation. Ah, what do you want? You ain't gonna ruin our lunch plans. I apologize for interrupting you before your meal. Himiko Toga, I must ask your help. Could you come with me? Huh? Right now? No way I'm letting you take her. Have a fun time. What a pain. If you're okay with it, Jin, I'll go. We can eat together another time. I'm always a little confused, like, on Jin, or I guess is twice, is like split personality. Like, what do they take serious that he says? Like, sometimes they go with his like normal way of speaking of like him talking like friendly with people and then sometimes they take his like mean way of talking as how he's saying it and so sometimes it's always so weird do, do they just say okay so means he is okay with both whether she stays or whether she goes with redestro or if it's just always the last sentence is what they go with it's like, okay, so twice wants me to go with him. I'll wait for you to come back. Toga, time to chow down. Like, see, with that one, 
I'm pretty sure he's not gonna wait for her. He's just gonna eat the food. Or if, like, he is gonna wait there, he's gonna eat and then just talk to her when she comes back. Story completion reward received. There we go. Got that normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, event one, stage one. Boom, boom. Uh, so the enemies are that. Well, I'll try to use these guys. Man, I really do need to like summon more in this game. It really hasn't been a priority for me to summon that much. All I do is the story events and stuff. I really don't focus on anything else. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, event two, let's go. Boom, boom, no, no, no. Boom, 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 but yeah, I wonder where this takes place. I guess this is after... Uh, I'm trying to remember what the arc is called. Event Story Chapter 2 Unlocked. Covert Operations Carmine 205. A covert mission? Yes, let me explain the details. Currently, several of our underlings are hidden at a remote front facility, collecting resources for the hideout. We have received a signal for assistance from the personnel positioned there. No. Assistance? Huh? What they do? Oi, oi. Get found out by the heroes? Not yet, but that is possible if we don't act now. This hidden facility... It has been targeted by another local villain organization, which attacked it. You really know how to set up bases in annoying places, huh? A rival villain organization. Is there any way to bring them into the front? We consider that, but they are just simple-minded gang of old-fashioned thugs. We decided they were not compatible with us. Oh. I see. Like relics from a long dead era. They are stuck in their ways. I like how it's the League of Villains kind of saying this, considering how they were a while ago. Where they just want to be the evildoers, but now they actually have smart plans on how they're going to take on the hero and societies. Resource procurement remains our priority. Our personnel there don't have time to waste messing with this villain organization. That is why we wanted you members of the Vanguard Intelligence Regiment to assist. Find and infiltrate the main base of the villain organization, and eliminate the entire organization. They have been exposed after the attack. Intelligence collection and infiltration are our specialties. We will quickly find this organization's base and infiltrate it. Please do so. Himiko Toga, we will greatly lean on your abilities for this mission. Hmm, what a pain. Don't you feel responsible as the commander of the regiment? I just want to live however I want. Tch, 
Fine. It may take a little time, but I'll get you the juice you wanted. <laughs> if this is what really convinces her, like, damn, that's all you have to do. Ah, that changes everything. I'll help with the mission. You have my thanks. Your combat abilities are quite valuable. They will be essential for the success of this mission. Skeptic. Is it okay to make such a grand promise? <laughs> what? Is changing their menu in the cafeteria a grand promise? It's just words. No way I'll actually go through with it. So they can't add juice onto the cafeteria menu? But there's one more thing. Hmm? What's that? I want to eat lunch before we go out on this mission. The Vanguard Intelligence Regiment sets off on the mission and meets with the local resource procurement team. Skeptic finds the base of the rival villain organization and the regiment prepares to infiltrate and eliminate it. La la la. Hey, is she okay? That toga girl? She is the commander of our regiment. She defeated Curious too. I know she's powerful. She doesn't look like it. I don't like it, but she may play the most important role in this mission. Skeptic? She doesn't follow orders, so it's a pain to work with her. But we should be able to complete this mission quicker with her. In any case, just worry about yourselves. Ah! Alright, mission three. Boom, 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 boom. They instantly got burned. <laughs> Crazy girl is buffing up. Okay, let's hear with this. Boom boom. Dobby, burn her! A little overkill, but I mean, it works. Boom. Chapter 3 unlocked. Covert Operations, Carmine 3 of 5. The Vanguard Intelligence Regiment approaches the main base of the villain organization. That store has such cute clothes. Let's go thereafter. We don't have time for that. Focus on the enemy. What's the situation? This is the villain base that you identified, Skeptic. That's definitely the right building. The organization is in complete control of building one there. They are using a fake company as cover. What's the point? They are really clueless. It's too risky to set up a fake company. Why not use a real company as cover? If we left them be, the police or heroes would easily find them and eliminate them. Idiots! I mean, I guess the only reason they're coming after these guys is because they're attacking their business. Or, like, trying to come in on their territory. But this problem can solve itself because these guys are apparently dumb. But we have to take them out before so they stop messing with our guys. However, they are interfering with our activities. They may have also realized who we are in their attack. That's right. We have no choice but to eliminate them. However, we can't cause a scene and risk exposing our team here. 
So, we will infiltrate the building and quickly eliminate them from the inside. After that, we can resume our resource collection activities. You can understand that much, right Toga? Hi. Yep! By the way, what resources are they collecting? Gotta be something important, huh? You don't know. Tch. It's food supplies for hiding out, and medical supplies for the coming battle. Plus, they are collecting liberationist personnel and negotiation material against our rival organization. Ugh! I'm sorry I asked. Wait, I don't understand. Why is she disgusted or didn't want to hear? Because from what I got, it's like they're trying to collect more people to join their cause and potentially hostages. And that doesn't seem like something that would bother Toga. I assure you, they are using peaceful means to collect these resources. Peaceful? But this mission is the elimination of an organization. Punishing villains with no redeeming merits contributes to society as a whole. It surely benefits the peace. Hmm. Got it. You're quick to understand. I see you have as much brains as the normal person. As the normal person? Well, that's a weird line. I mean, I think he would say as much as normal people. Spinner and the others told me to do it, so I guess I'll just do it. <laughs> I guess he's pissed because she's not taking his orders, or at least read Destro's orders. She's only doing it because Shigaraki, Spinner, Dobby, and Capress, and Twice all told her to do it. Okay, I'm off then. Wait, there are villain guards patrolling around the building. They'll spot you. It's okay, they won't find me. You're a wanted criminal known across Japan. Hey, regiment members, follow Toga. Yes, sir. Damn it, that girl. All I can do now is provide support from here. Hey, wait. We'll get spotted if you guys hang around. Stay back. But, ah! She disappeared into the crowd. Gone in an instant. Toga, there are two men, three meters in front of you. They are the villain organization members on patrol. Then I'll just... Whoosh! Oh, that reminds me, about yesterday. Huh? Where did that cut come from? You didn't have that before. What? Oh, you're right. Did I get poked somewhere? Commander Toga, finally found you. It's time to go back. Hi. Yep, let's go back. Are you done? Why did you run out like that? I had to get this. That person's blood. Boom, 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 doom, 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 doom. Yeah, I can only imagine how this mission is gonna go. Like, if my hero was a much more brutal anime. Like, I can just imagine them, like, slitting throats and just absolutely destroying these guys. But I'm guessing that's not gonna happen. Like, I don't know. These are villains, so they may kill. Like, it says that their mission is to eliminate 
the other villains, but I somehow don't believe that they're just gonna straight up kill these guys. Boom, 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 boom. All right, chapter four. Damn, the story is pretty quick. Covert Operations, Carmine 405. Inside the main building of the Target Villain Organization. Yo, I'm back. So I'm guessing this is Toga. How she's speaking so casual as this guy. I bet this guy would be more formal in his own base. Also, the question mark is usually, it's like, this is villain A? Question mark? Welcome back. Huh? Did you already finish your patrol? What about the other guy you were with? He's still out on patrol with me. Well, <laughs> okay, so she's kind of blowing her cover, but probably gonna save this. Huh? What are you saying? Is that a knife? You the only entrance guard? Your security is really lacking, huh? You! Ugh! Hi. Everyone! You can come in now! You already secured the entrance! What about the security cameras? I've already hacked them. The building security cameras, communication systems, and electronic locks are in my control. Infiltrate the building with Toga. Go in and support her. Then just take down each enemy. Understood. Ugh. Ugh. You. Hey, what's the matter? You're covered in blood. Our comrades suddenly attacked me. It's a rebellion. They betrayed us. Okay, so this is weird. He didn't see Toga, like, take her normal form, or he didn't hear that meeting that they had at the entrance. He still thinks it's his comrades, and so what, are they going to be fighting each other while being taken out by the Liberation Front? What the? Everyone, prepare for combat right away! Huh? A power outage? Of all times! In the darkness... Spark some infighting, and let's reduce their numbers. Yeah, yeah. Guac. Hey, what was that yell? Are you alright? What the heck? Ugh. Someone hit me. I'll hit you back. Wait, don't swing around weapons in here. That hurts. Ah, big bro. Sorry. I wasn't trying to do that. Are you one of the traitors? You're going down! No! They hit me too! Ugh. It's you, isn't it? Amazing! In an instant, most of the members are fighting each other and doing our work for us. You can see the remaining members with the night vision goggles. Clear them up and move on to the next floor. Yeah, man, I really want to see this, like, animated, or at least see this in the manga. Because this would be, like, pretty brutal. I would imagine something, I don't know, like, Van Helsing or Hel Helsing Ultimate. Like, something like that going on. Or w some of the other animes where it's, like, just brutal. Just killing. It's, like, stabbing, neck slicing. And probably, like, silent shot with silencers. Hi. Gotcha! Gyaa! What the? Commander Toga defeated all the remaining enemies in an instant. Office of the Leader of the Villain Organization. What the hell is happening on the lower floors? Why isn't anyone sending a report? That's because Skeptic cut all the phone lines. By the way, 
He locked the exits too. Who the hell are you? They said that she was the most one of the most wanted criminals in Japan, and yet this dude doesn't know. I'm Toga. Hey there. A high school girl. Why are you in a place like this? <laughs> Man, that has so many implications I don't even want to say. Do I look like a normal high school girl? No, you go silent. Sorry. You aren't really my type. Alright, so last battle. Boom, 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 boom. Damn, all that immunity. Man, he really did survive. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. I thought he was gonna survive more than one turn. I was like, damn it! We have to use another super attack on him. Activate destroy mode just as you're about to die. How unfortunate. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, now time for the final mission or final cutscene. Yep, chapter 5. Covert Operations, Carmine, 5 of 5. Since I hacked them, there will be no tracks in the security camera tapes or audio. But still, somebody is gonna be like, What the hell happened here? Why did all these guys die so brutally? I mean, I guess they'll think that there was a rebellion or infighting. But still, it's like there was no survivors, not even at least one group is the winner. Both teams just so happen to take each other out but just in case collect all electronic devices we can't have any trace of us left yes sir hmm, hmm. this mission was easier than I thought all thanks to my perfect support why can't you get that no that's not all I get why Toga was chosen as commander now. Oh, so it means he tries to take all the credit. And I guess tries to get her to be like, yep, all thanks to you. But then he probably would think of that as a backhanded compliment or something. But the Carmine members know who the true hero or MVP of this mission was, which was Toga. Later in the Gunga Mountain Villa hideout, Paranormal Liberation Front. I'm back! Oh, it's Toga. Hey everyone, Toga is back. You did great work on this mission. Our supply procurement work is moving ahead without issue. Great job. Your accomplishments are already on the news. Hidden villain organization base destroyed in a single night. Was it an inside job? Uh. Seems like there were some people arrested. How'd you do that? So wait, I don't understand. They did leave survivors? And it wasn't as brutal as I thought? Like, I thought they killed everyone, but apparently not. They just injured a lot of people. And I guess called the police on this place. We set up the outside patrolmen as the culprits. Toga transformed and we fabricated some evidence. Oh, okay, that is actually sinister. I was like, they killed everyone there. It's like, who were the fall guys? But yeah, I guess it was the two guys that were on patrol that she first got the blood from. 
And then after murdering all those guys, they called the police on the two and then probably told the police, hey, go check out this place where their base was and then found all the dead bodies. And it's like, okay, you guys are under arrest for the murder of the 15 guys or yeah, let, let's just say 15 guys. And then probably got a couple lives in prison. Of course, she pretended to be the victim and reported this incident to the police as well. Toga really is amazing. No big deal. Having access to your quirks really is helpful. Redestro made the right choice in accepting the League. Sure. Don't forget, you surrendered to us. Don't act like we're friends. Hey, Toga, there's a gift addressed to you. It's from the Carmine Regiment members. Huh? For me? What is this? Cooler packs? Are these bottles inside? Oh, is this a upgrade that she got? I guess before, like, the current arc? Is this backstory slash lore on how she got an upgrade? Because if this is actually canon on how she gets an upgrade, then that's kind of a cool detail for like a little bit of a future arc. It's like if she comes with this new pack that is able to help her hold more blood or at least get blood faster. It's juice. I hear you like pomegranate. The cook was able to get his hands on it. Okay, so I'm a little confused. So, was the gift from Skeptic or was it from the Carmine guys? Yeah, I don't know. So, is the gift like an upgrade or is it the juice? That's the gift. Huh, you ordered it just for me. Yay! Look at that, Toga. Your subordinates really respect you. You're always so flighty. I just figured they underestimated you. Huh? Yeah, I haven't really thought about that. Hmm. This is yummy. Don't talk while you drink juice. Ha 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 ha. Seems like the commanders of the Vanguard Intelligence Regiment have gotten a little closer. Closer? What part of this conversation would make you think so? The part where you gave her a gift. Nah. You two were able to work together to complete this mission. Right, Toga? Slurp, slurp. Say something, Toga! First, you don't want me to talk. Now you do. What a pain. Haha. <laughs> -ha. Good point. You're the one who's the pain. You simpletons! I knew I couldn't see eye to eye with you. Alright, I think that was a fun little mission. Seeing all the villains interact together. I just love these events where the villains go on missions. Because, I don't know, something's more fulfilling about seeing them all work together than the heroes going on individual missions. Because the hero cast is much bigger, and so it feels like every hero event is more separate. While whenever it's the villains, it's always the League of Villains that are doing something together. And so, I don't know, it just seems like it's much better to see these guys all going on missions together, being happy, to work together and like getting stronger to take on the heroes for whatever future arc that happens. But yeah, I thought that was a fun little cool event. Seeing uh, Skeptic and Toga kind of seeing eye to eye. Seeing like how Toga is good even though she's ridiculous looking and how she acts. And so Skeptic now kind of respects her. Now I don't know if like in the anime slash manga he actually respects her. 
seeing that in this little event kind of warms my heart up a little bit. And plus, I think it was kind of funny to see how a skeptic was reacting every time Toga was doing something ridiculous. And like how nonchalant Toga was the entirety of the event. Oh, it's trying to get me to buy stuff. Lovely. But yeah, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed My Hero Ultra Impact. If you guys did, please make sure to follow me on all my social medias, like my Twitter, my Twitch, my YouTube, my DLive, my TikTok, my Kick, Rumble, Odyssey, and Daily Motion. Make sure to check out my second YouTube channel, and like and comment on all my videos, and even join my Discord. There you can stay up to date with everything I choose to watch my streams, videos, or anything else. But yeah, I hope to see you guys next time. Bye.